Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be showing you this new M12 fuel mini shop vac that I ended up picking up. Uh, I got this for obviously just sweeping up some stuff around the shop. You have small little projects that you don't want to go get out the huge shop vac uh, and trip over cords and hoses and stuff. Uh, I thought this would be useful to be able to bust this thing out and make quick light work of uh, just sweeping up some stuff like I said when you don't want to use the actual huge shop vac. Also I thought this would be really really nice for being able to take out and sweep out my truck with so I'm gonna open it up check it out uh, on the side of the box it is stated some runtime here with a 6 amp hour battery I don't have any 6 amp hour batteries um, but for that battery, it's saying 14 minutes on high and 26 minutes on low. So I really have no clue what to expect my runtime is going to be. It says it works with all M12 batteries. I have a 2 amp hour battery I'm going to try to use it with. So I think I might do a runtime test on that and see what 2 amp hours will get you. You would think it would be close to a third of what you would get with the 6 amp hour, but We'll check it out and see. So one thing I did notice whenever I was kind of looking at these online, uh, I thought it was really cool that everything is inside of this. The hose, the attachments, everything. That way you can just pick it up, just like a toolbox throw it in the back of your truck, take it with you wherever you have, uh, you know, some sweeping that you have to do. So pretty much in the package, this is just what you get. There's literally nothing else. Uh, so everything is inside here. So that's pretty cool. The hose is actually uh, like stretchable and actually goes back. That's pretty cool. That's pretty much it. So you got two attachments. This here, which is a wall mount. So in the bottom, just have your filter, twists on and off, um, pretty simple. So this also does have a blower port on the side too, um, along with the suction, and it also will do wet or dry. So I mean it pretty much does everything that your normal shop vac would do. I just want to see how quiet it is and how much power. It has also how long it will run with a 2 amp hour battery. I have a Milwaukee ratchet and drill that run on the M12. So that's why I got this vacuum because I already had the batteries and charger. Um, I've seen other kits that use a 4 amp hour, but I haven't seen anybody run a 2 amp hour. So even if I can get just a few minutes of being able to use this, on the 2 amp hour, I'll be happy. Um, this is just going to be for small quick jobs. So this here is a fully charged 2 amp hour actual Milwaukee brand M12 battery. That's low. That's high. So 
So that's literally the first time I tried this. Um, even on the lowest setting, it's still really powerful. Um, so I think I initially said we were going to test it on high, but I want to do a low speed test to see how long this 2 amp hour will last. Um, battery gauge is showing full. Okay, so I do want to test this thing out real quick just before I do my runtime test. Uh, here I have some aluminum shavings from the mill, so we'll throw those down. I'm thinking that's going to be where probably the high power is going to come in. Uh, and then I just have some sawdust here. That I'm thinking probably the low power will be able to suck that up no problem. So this here is going to be on the low setting. That was all on the low setting. I'm pretty surprised it was even able to pick up all these aluminum and steel chips. I'm going to try it on the high setting now. Well, that worked absolutely awesome. Uh, even on the low power setting, still had plenty of power. So like you just saw, this thing works absolutely awesome. Um, it's really, really powerful. Uh, pretty impressed with it. So uh, we're going to do the runtime test now. See, even after, I've used that maybe only a few seconds. So we're going to see what type of runtime we can get now on the low setting. Because honestly, that low setting sucked up even heavy metal chips. So, uh, I think that's going to work for 90% of the stuff I'm looking to do. So, that's what I would use would be the low setting to conserve battery. And just because there's not really any need for the high setting. Uh, at least whenever you're just sweeping up stuff that's just kind of laying around. Okay, so it just shut off. Uh, that was just under nine minutes. So with what I swept up before, I would say it's about nine minutes on low for a two amp hour battery. So there you have it. We got about nine minutes of run time on the two amp hour battery on low. So obviously it's gonna be less on full power, but as you saw in the test, low power has plenty of power as it is um, so all in all definitely really pumped up and excited to have this tool and hopefully it'll make life a little bit easier so if you like this video hit the like button subscribe for more videos and I'll catch you guys next time later